Okay, it's August. Movies, Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh, happy day, it's here at last. After six years of superheroes, Marvel Studios is finally expanding its horizons with the galactic adventures of Peter Quill and his ragtag group of deadly misfits. I don't even know what I should say here. In fact, if you're watching this video, chances are the movie is already out in a theater near you, so just go already. This movie is going to be so good that nothing after it can bring me down. Not even... Uh... Okay, let's look at the positives here. I like the turtle design, and the action looks cool, and the humor is actually pretty good. Oh, look, he's doing his Batman voice. Back off, Rat! So, how bad could this movie possibly... <laughs> Why? Why do this to me? Why give me hope only to rip it away? And why? Why? Why is Whoopi Goldberg in this? Uh, let's just move on. Into the storm. Hey, remember how in Twister it seemed like the tornadoes were actively hunting the main characters, practically trying to destroy them? Well, this movie looks to be multiplying that by about a hundred. But hey, Twister was 18 years ago. There's a whole new generation of kids out there that haven't experienced a movie about improbably aggressive weather systems blowing everything around. And speaking of things that people under 20 don't know about, the Expendables 3. The action star retirement franchise continues, adding Mel Gibson, Harrison Ford, Wesley Snipes, Antonio Banderas, and Kelsey Grammer to the cast. Um, okay. Whatever. If there's a plot, nobody cares about it. Just enjoy these classic movie stars play off each other and blow up a ton of stuff. And if that's not enough gratuitous action for you, don't worry, because we got Sin City. A dame to kill for. About damn time. It has been nearly a decade since the first movie, but since that has allowed Eva Green to be cast for it, I'd say it's worth the wait. A Dame to Kill For is the one storyline from Frank Miller's original run that didn't make it into the first film. It'll be accompanied by an adaptation of Just Another Saturday Night and two original stories written by Miller for the movie. And I cannot wait. And now, let's get a little scary with Jezebel. Okay, let's play Horror Movie Bingo, Creepy Old House, Haunted Videotapes, Spooky Swamp Setting, Bad Voodoo Magic, and a Ghost Attack in the Bath. Bingo! And really, who takes a bath in the dark in the middle of a haunted house anyway? That's just asking for trouble. And speaking of things that are never a good idea, As above, so below. When archaeologists decide to snoop around the Paris underground, they go a little bit too deep and, well, end up in hell. Turns out it was in France the whole time. Who knew? Okay, we all know I'm a sucker for found footage and this does look pretty good, so I'll probably end up checking this one out. Man, that's what we have for movies coming up in August. Tell me how much you're looking forward to Guardians of the Galaxy in the comments below. Maybe hit that like button, pass this video around to your friends, and have a great month.